back at uh, Dockery Namath Camp with John Dockery, and when we speak to somebody like John, who has that ring on, it's just a, an overwhelming feeling as a New York fan to think about the camaraderie and and uh, you know the great experience you guys provided for everybody. What a great experience! And if you were looking closely at the ring, you could see it has your name, number, etc. The score when we beat the Colts in that great Super Bowl three as huge underdogs. It also has two words on the ring uh, engraved, poise and execution. And the feeling was that we were in this, you know, this, uh, in the underdog role, so much 18-point underdogs, people saying, don't even bother to show up. I mean, come on, the NFL and the AFL. It was a different time then. We were in the AFL. You guys are in an inferior league, and the NFL is going to bury you, and the Colts were good. Um, but as it turned out, Joe's guarantee worked, and we upset them, and uh, it's uh, it's been a joy ever since. It's one of those magic moments, you know. I still remember being in the Orange Bowl and the sun going down and saying, wow, we're going to win the Super Bowl. <laughs> <laughs> Two years earlier, I'm, I'm at in Cambridge at Harvard playing Ivy League football, and then, wow, the Super Bowl. With Joe Willie and Don Maynard and George Sauer and Matt Snell and Emerson Boozer. It was a good moment in time, I'll tell you, a sweet moment in time. And, well, and uh, you know, I mean, it's been a lot of years. I mean, I think in a way, when I look at it, it's, it's a great moment, but also it's a very tough moment for the Jet franchise and the guys there now. You know, they need to get break the ice and get another Super Bowl, and they came so close uh, in the last two years going to the AFC Championship game, and uh, I think they have a good shot. Rex Ryan is, I, I think he's a terrific coach, and he's one of those rare people that can motivate different types of personalities. And he's been able to do it. I had his father as my coach with the Jets. That's he right. was a defensive coach along with Walt Michaels. And uh, <laughs> he was one piece of works as well. Tough, had a sense of humor, maybe not quite as developed as Rex. <laughs> <laughs> and he, of course, he went on to be a head coach as well yeah, and did yeah. well. Um, but, uh, you know, that I think that thread, I mean, Rex grew up in football, knows about it, learned about it, and he's done a spectacular job with the Jets, and Sanchez is getting better and better. They can retain some of the free agents. Who knows what might happen, you know? That last year, imagine beating Peyton Manning and Tom Brady. Back to back. Back to back, and not getting to the Super Bowl. Oh, my goodness. Two big-time games, so they're capable of beating anybody, and it's about time after 40 years and another group of rings show up somewhere. Well, let's get it done this, this year, John. Uh, you know, great chatting with you and continued success with, at the camp. And, uh, you know, it's just been a wonderful experience for us here at BroadwayJoe.tv uh, to come up and, and spend some time with you. Thank you. I appreciate it.